Good day everyone, Mr. Comics 89 here, and I got a lot of stuff today, and I mean a lot of stuff. I expected one thing, maybe even two packages, I didn't expect four to show up. <laughs> uh, it's been a week. It's been a week and I have at least 20 more hours at work before it's over. I lose one of my I lose one of my days on the weekend, so I get one day of rest this weekend, basically. One day to get a good night's sleep and to relax and all that other crap. So it's just gonna be there. So if I seem a little less than excited, I apologize. It's because it has been a long, hard week, and it's not over yet. Ugh. I'm so done with my free trial of adulthood. I want to go back to being a kid. Can I do that? Can I uh, end the free trial? <laughs> anyway, before I show you those, I'm going to show you these two books. This last week was a new light new comic book day, including Spider Gwen, Gwenverse. You know, number two here. I enjoyed. I enjoyed the book. Although I kind of find it funny the reflective covers on Thor. Gwyn Thor and all that, that the two of the reflective panels that Thor has are <clears throat> right near her <coughs> other, ha other headlights. <laughs> yeah. And funny, huh? Yeah, it's very, very fun. Pretty cover. And then I got Punisher number one, second printing. I wasn't gonna, I was gonna pass this completely up. You know, I heard Reggie talking about it, so I figured I'll give the first issue a read. And after I did, it was good. I'm glad I I'm glad I got it. You know, I'm glad I read it. I'm not gonna pull up. I'm not gonna feel like Punisher. You know, I almost I almost bought this weekend a uh, Punisher number one four issue miniseries print number one. You know, but I passed up on it. Not you know the only Punisher key I really care about is that one. First appearance, 129, but uh, it's a good book. All right. Uh, I lift the bag a little bit. Great. Uh, it was. Well. Yeah, it happened because of other reasons, and I won't go into the details. All right. This first one here was, well these first two technically are from Southern Comic Geek. This one I got from my monthly Patreon support package, you know what I bought. This only this time I got was a Funko. The last one, the second one is uh, some books that I got on his Whatnot channel. Yep. One of the pops I wanted, or one of the Funko sodas that I wanted, Green Lantern. 2,500 pieces, or 12,500 12, 12, pieces. I don't have to guess, you know, because you wouldn't have sold it for $15 or whatever if it had been anything but the common. But. Since the chase, the White Lantern, I wanted both of these characters eventually, if I can get my hands on him. But I wanted the Green Lantern Soda. It'll look good right up there next to the other members of Justice League. So. Cool guy. good on my display shelf over there, so Green Lantern. Alright. Now to show you the books that I got from Southern's Whatnot auction. 
first time he did it, he did it at a late night auction. Because he usually does them like on Fridays, you know, 9 o'clock in the morning or 8 o'clock in the morning my time, 9 o'clock his time when I'm working and can't join. You know, this is like, sucks. I and mean, I'm glad you can do it during the day like that. Wish I could watch it or listen to it. But, anyway. Caught this one. Grabbed a few books that I wanted. Ah, there we go. Alright. Um, he threw in one book because, um, I already bought, I bought, I want, I bought it, and, um, it, um, threw in one book that I already bought over Instagram from him, but, um, saved on shipping, obviously combining it, and that book was Green Lantern 49, part of the Blackest Night. Um, A cover, I believe. Um, I want the B cover, too, you know, John Stewart, you know, Green Green Lantern, Snipering cover. It's a cool cover. I decided I want all the Green Lantern, Jeff John books. You know, and uh, that's one of the books I needed. Um, Miles Morales, Spider-Man number 23. From lot four. Oh, that's very cool. There is a clear backing board on this book. I'm gonna have to move that to a different bag that I can show off my back. Back of the book. There, very cool. Cause it wasn't um, totally soft. That's cool. My first uh, clear book there. Um, Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man number 24. It was just part of that One More Day storyline and just... Decided to get it, you know. Part of the lot, I guess. And, um, Spider-Girl number 52. Collecting Spider Girl. I needed this one, so looks like Spider Girl's in a uh, Carnage symbiote. Interesting look. All right, um, next package. I went on a Chase Collectibles website. I was looking for a certain pop. I mistook a sticker for theirs. I guess it said Chase Collectibles and it pop in a box. But I decided I found a couple of Spider Spider-Man related Funko Pops that I wanted decided to get while I was there. <sighs> I apologize for the noise. Um Iron Spider, 287, from the Infinity War. I have the other Iron Spider, you know, from uh, in-game, where he's in the um, kill mode, red eyes and all that. So, very, very cool. Technically, I would need... Uh, Okay, I already have, I do have that one, Iron, that Iron Spider. Um, yeah, I don't really need any of the other, uh, pops from this run. Because I'm only really interested in the Spider-Man pop. And the other book. Sorry. The other book, other pop. Long day. I have two hours before I go to bed and start the other day all over again. Um, Poison Spider-Man from Venom story, from Venom line or whatever. This is a uh, Entertainment Earth exclusive sticker. 
Just a really, really cool... He looks like Agent Anti-Venom, or Anti-Venom. He's just very, very cool. So... And again, just one's, one's in the back. Out of all of those, I like the Venomized X-23. And then that... I don't know if I would get any of the others. Almost flicked that out of my hand. <laughs> Long day. Very, very cool. All right. And this one here is from another, what is a whatnot auction. Um, I think it's the, uh, Sir Pops. Oh, Sir Pop-a-lot. You know, I think that's his, uh, whatnot tag or channel. One, two, and three. It's definitely Sir Pop because uh, when I got from them last time, they sent it in the orange, uh, orange bubble wrap. Ah. All right. All right, here we go. Um, this is from a uh, Marvel's a, a Marvel Collector Core exclusive. I grabbed this Iron Man, you know, from Tales of Suspense number 39. I guess it's not, it wasn't the original Iron Man one, Iron Man Silver Suit one that there would have been, I guess, but this is the one, this is the one it was from the, from the comic. And so, I basically, I, I like the whole, sil I like the whole first Iron Man pop, or suit, you know, silver like that, and just, I got it, you know, it was very cool, it's a way to get an Iron Man pop that had history to the character, I guess. You know, rather than getting a million different Iron Man pops or whatever, this one is kind of just ties into the movie, ties into the book. All right, which one do next? Teeny, meeny, miny, mo. Ah, this one. Well, I'm glad I picked this one. Save the uh, one I like the most for last. Well, this one needs to get the uh, protective sheet off of it so it doesn't have that foggy look to it. Oh, she popped out. I gotta fix that tonight. X23, Toys R Us exclusive. I like X-23, like how she's female looking Wolverine there, very, very cool. See she uh, popped out, at least her feet did, so I gotta fix that. Alright, moving on, because I don't like that being there, like that, alright. At least this one didn't uh, pop out. Uh, uh. Alright. Um, another Spider-Man pop, because like I said, if I was gonna if I was gonna narrow down my collecting on Funko Pops down to you know 90% this and 10% everything else, it would have been 90% Spider-Man related. You know. You know, and that being a broad term, I guess, because some Spider-Man pops I wouldn't want to get. You know, like Peter Parker and his uh, sweatshirt or whatever from Homecoming. You know, cool. I'd rather have Spider-Man. I'd rather have an unmasked Spider-Man showing Peter Parker's face than a Peter Parker. 
Anyway, this is Scarlet Spider, the Kane Parker pop, not uh, Ben Riley Scarlet Spider. And this is a Walgreens exclusive. So, this he, this is the Spider Him in the Spider Suit that appeared after in the Spider Island, you know, and in his own Scarlet Spider series. I think it was 23 or 25 issues. Interesting. I have the other Sandman and Craven pops, so I have these three. Anyway. So there you go. You got three Spider-Man related pops. Three Spider-Man related pops, an Iron Man and a uh and, and a uh, X-23. So <laughs> technically speaking, two clones and all that. So anyway, that's the video. I appreciate you guys for stopping by. Um, description below will be a link to my 750 subscriber contest video. Currently doing a you know, contests for 750 subscribers, giving away a lot of Spider-Man related books. Like, um, I have three or four issues of, uh, the first Gibbon, ASM 110. You know, I got a duplicate of ASM 215 and a couple of Spider-Man doubles throughout my collection of my complete ASM collection. So I'm going to be giving Spider-Man related books you know, for a, a big lot. And some other books I find along the way that I'll throw in. You know, like I might throw in a Superman or a, uh, a Venom, you know, or Fantastic Four issue. If I say, uh, I'll just go ahead and toss that in, you know, kind of a thing. So who knows why I decide to throw in ultimately, but it'll be a decent sized stack, you know, of uh, Spider-Man related books for 750 subscribers so rules are in the video or in the link in the, in the video description just follow the link there are two ways there are two two kind of contests um or ways to enter the contest two different things you can do you can do both or you can do one and if you do both you can get up to 14 entries depending for the comp contest depending on how you enter so again the video the rules will be described um rules will be in the video and the description. Sorry. Below, just follow the, click the link. And, uh, but you must be subbed, you must be subbed to my channel to officially enter the contest. Um, otherwise, if you're not subbed, I won't count your entries and you can't win. You know, say it, simple, simple, fair, right? Anyway, have a good night. I hope you guys have a good weekend and, uh, Enjoy your sleep, because I know I need it. <laughs> Take care. Happy collecting.